Hi everyone, I'm Thea Andrews. Kelsey Knight is here with me. Hey Thea, let's get right to the big story that we're following closely. I'm 22 years old and I'm still a virgin. Killer Elliot Roger, an angry outcast, completely obsessed with being a virgin. I'm 22 years old and I've never had a girlfriend. I'm still a virgin. I think what we have here is a really extreme case of narcissistic personality disorder. Somebody like this needs to be puffed up, and when they feel rejected, they deflate like a balloon and become enraged. Clinical and forensic psychologist Cheryl Arrett explains why young men like Roger, who are still a virgin, refer to themselves as incels or involuntary celibates. Being a virgin was absolutely agonizing because this was evidence that nobody really wanted him. This was someone who was not getting any and not because it was by choice. Roger became fascinated with the lack of attention he got from young women. That obsession led him to become immersed in the online community called PUAHate.com, otherwise known as Pickup Artist. So PUAHate.com is a site that Elliot Roger was using, and in essence, this site is for people who have been using pickup artistry tactics or books or coaches and have had no success and go there to really vent about their lack of success in the area. Sex and relationship expert Shannon Boudram, author of the book Laid, explains why men like Roger are flocking to this particular forum. Elliot Roger was using PUAHate.com as a way really to affirm his negative beliefs and to vent about his dissatisfaction with women in general and the kind of men that he believes that women are attracted to. I have to watch other guys able to walk around and enjoy their lives with beautiful girlfriends at their side. I can only imagine how amazing their sex lives must be. Seeing other men score the attention of women drove Roger to madness. One of those guys specifically mentioned in Roger's 137 page manifesto was college football player Lucky Radley. Rogers wrote, Lucky Radley immediately became popular with the girls of his grade. I hated him for it. Radley was shocked over Roger's immense hatred. I never heard him talk. I, I've, I've never heard him say more than two, three words. Today, the Santa Barbara campus canceled classes to honor those who were killed. We're also getting a glimpse of another victim, Nick Pasachuk, who's lucky to be alive after being struck by Elliot's car. The uproar over Roger's misogynistic behavior has also led to over one and a half million mentions with the hashtag, yes, all women. Celebrities like Lena Dunham, James Vanderbeek and Sophia Bush are using it to promote female empowerment and to stop violence against women. This kind of hatred, this kind of misogyny is unacceptable and they want to use this to band together and basically say, see what happens when we don't challenge hatred and violence against women. We need to stand up. We will continue to follow this story closely. But right now, here's what else is trending on Yahoo Celebrity.